welcome back to my channel success engineering official as I told you we have to draw the riser diagram in the next tutorials my previous tutorials I have already told you we have to prepare the riser diagram so you can see here this is the elevation of the building I have prepared it so this is your underground uh, domestic water tank and this is the overhead water tank okay domestic overhead water tank and this is the pump so see, uh, this is the elevation of the building okay so simply write it here simply copy the text copy the text and place it here okay and uh, click uh, right click and go to this property and text height is 350 in the text height and uh, simply double click to edit so this is a uh, underground underground domestic water tank domestic water tank underground domestic water tank and this is your transfer pump this is your transfer pump transfer pump this is your transfer pump okay and this water is going uh, and simply copy this one this water is going up to this overhead water tank this is your overhead water tank Over, overhead water tank overhead domestic water tank And from this overhead water tank, this water is going down to each floor. So simply this is the ground floor. Actually there are two toilets. So simply copy this. Okay. And this is your ground floor. Ground floor. Toilet. One okay, and I simply copy this, place it here. Ground floor toilet number two, okay, and uh, same thing you have to copy. Simply select this one and copy and place it here. So, this is your first floor. First floor toilet one, and this is your first floor toilet number two. First floor toilet number two. Okay. Now we have to write the GPM. So you can see here, this is the GPM uh, for the first floor. You can see here for the uh, ground floor, th thirty-two fixture unit. For the both and uh, GPM is 23 and diameter is 2 inch so here will be your 32 fixture unit okay here to copy this one here 32 fixture unit and GPM is you can write everything from here so here is GPM is 23.3 and pipe size is 2 inch copy this that uh, 23.3 GPM okay and pipe size is copy this down 2 inch so double click to edit button C okay and uh, 
is dia is to h this is your how you write and similarly you have to write it here so copy this one and place it this side because this floor is going this much of gpm so here for this floor you can see here Level, uh, 4 WC 4 hands per 1 sink 3 laboratories so 4 WC 4 hands per laboratories are 3 and sink is 1 laboratories 3 sink is 1 so you have to uh, you can see here this is the GPM 31.5 so 31.5 you have to write it here you need to have to look for the fixture and how much GPM is 31.5 so fixture unit is sorry fixture unit is 31.5 so 32 is here 30 okay so 23.3 so approximate same 32 31 31.5 fixture unit 31.5 is approximate 32 you have to consider and GPM is same and pipe size is also same okay so what will be the pipe size here actually the, this is the main thing we have to write it so your pipe size here will be simply copy this you have to copy this one see lips here simply copy this text uh, take one uh, line one line here like this match this line to this line okay simply use match command and simply match this okay now we have to copy this, this text copy and paste it here here ok so total fixture unit is 32 32 oh, you have to add this one 32 plus 32 so it is 64 so here your fixture unit will be 64 64 fixture unit so pipe size is you have to check it from here 33 GPM okay so the for 33 GPM you have to calculate the pipe size GPM is 33 33 GPM so what will be the pipe size so you have to check it from here in this table here this is the 31, 32, 33 little bit up and you have to draw the 2 fps uh, this is the main pipe actually no this is the gravity system ok so 2 fps is only so this is a approximate 2 and a half so here 2 and a half pipe size 2 and a half inch Okay, so this is your pipe size. Similarly, you have to write this uh, for this first uh, ground, uh, first floor toilet uh, branch. So, you have to copy this one. Click copy this, go up, place it here. Then, uh, for this uh, toilet, what will be the pipe size? Okay, so. You have to check it here. Uh, four uh, hand spray, four WC, and uh, two laboratories. So four hand spray, four WC, and two laboratories. Sink there is no sink. There is no sink. So twenty nine fixture unit. So twenty nine fixture unit. You have to check it here. 
here uh, fixed reward will be the GPM so 29 is uh, nothing but 30 so 23.3 so approximate same 23.3 GPM so pipe size is 2 inch and this also will be the same ok so here will be your ok here your pipe size will be added this all this ok no this is actually for the uh, one and actually two riser is going so uh, this is for the one riser only so to draw two riser parallel to this ok two riser like this like this ok and simply trim this one the two riser is going to two riser ok like this from the two riser is going uh, for each uh, one is uh, one riser is going for one and two uh, first and second toilet for the ground and first floor and second riser is going for this one so your pipe size here will be you have to move this one move this side okay and move this line also so this is your for this toilet uh, for uh, ground floor and first floor uh, toilet one and two Similarly for this one also is same So you have to move this you have To move this text to this side okay, And this one you need to erase it Simply copy this Okay, and place it here Here Take one line like this match this one so use match properties simply match this line so like this okay so this is your you can see here also in this fixture it is 33 and gpm is 34 two and a half okay so 61 two and a half so here is approximate so you can write it like this Two and a half pipe size is two and a half and GPM is thirty three. It should be same because I added this in this and for ground floor and first floor added here and here will be also you have to move this. You cannot write it here, you need to move it here. Like this here. Because this ground floor and first floor toilet on toilet two will be added and write it here. So I think you guys learn something from this video and uh, this is the we have now we have completed this cold water and domestic water pipe sizing and designing so in the next tutorial we guys learn how to uh, we have to learn for the uh, heating system and hot water pipe size and hot water capacity calculation so thank you for watching my video thank you bye bye